Look, ladies, this is the number one thing. This is going to be a short video, but I want to emphasize this because it is the most important thing that you guys have to do in your lives when it comes to relationships. The number one thing to look for in a man, it is not how big his bank account is. <laughs> it is not how funny he is. It is not how rich he is. It is not if he has a Facebook, a YouTube account. It is not um, um, how much money he has, where does he live, none of that shit. It is whether or not he is respectful. Look for disrespect. That's the one thing. Look for disrespect. By the way, we're having a 50% off all of my courses from today until the end of the year. So if you want to get my courses at a discount, go to my website and you can check out the coupon code on the description down below. Always be on the lookout for disrespect before anything. That's the number one thing you should be on the lookout. You want to know why? Because that's the number one arrow that's thrown at you. People are constantly trying to disrespect you. And people disrespect you to test you, to see what are you willing to, to, to accept and what are you willing to, put, to not accept. It is plain and simple. And when a guy meets a woman, he'll start by trying to disrespect you. He'll start out by being by trying to be selfish with you, right? He'll start out to see whether or not you're willing to accept the selfishness. Is he is she willing to be is she willing to let me be sexually selfish with her? Is she willing to let me be late without her saying anything? Is she willing to let me call her names? Is she willing to let me hit her without her saying anything in return? Right? These are things that guys will look for in a woman. And you wanna know why? Just like it, people. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this shit is fucking up, right? There you go. You want to know why? It's because of three things. One, humans are always throwing out signs of strength or weaknesses, right? right? All right, bitch. <laughs> humans are always sending either signs of strength or weakness. It is just human nature. Two, humans are always sensing for strength or weakness. In other words, a guy will try to disrespect you to see how willing how willing are you to call him out. And three, uh, humans cannot resist an easy target. In other words, humans cannot resist a woman, a guy cannot resist disrespecting a woman who lets him disrespect her. It's that simple. And, and, look, and look, ladies, 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 look, my, even though I am the toxic dating coach, my number one priority is to help you gain, um, um, is to help you gain healthy relationships I, I like i know it sounds crazy and and the reason why i teach the toxic side is to is to give you more of a defense mechanism against disrespect a defense mechanism against people playing bullshit against you so how do you build that how do you build those muscles you build it up by first of all look back in your life the things that guys have done that led to disrespect okay it started out with the small things. What were the small signs that a guy was going to be disrespectful? Maybe he was late to the date. For me, a sign that a woman is going to disrespect me is... Let me see. A sign that a woman is going to disrespect me for the most part is when she cancels the date on the last minute. It, it, it never turns out good, to be honest with you. That, 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 for me, that's one sign. Another sign is when she's always on her phone, right? Always on her phone when she's with me. That, that shows that she, that, that she just doesn't respect me. It, it, it is that simple. I'm just giving you guys some examples that usually lead to disrespect. Another sign is taking, day, taking like 10 hours to respond. When a woman does that, she doesn't give a fuck about losing me. She just doesn't give a fuck about losing me. She doesn't care to lose me, right? All of those things that says I, I, I could take you, you gotta take it or leave it, that kind of attitude, it's disrespectful. With those kind of people, you wanna cut them off. You want to cut them off at the spot. And the reason why is because you don't even wanna engage with them. You don't, you don't even wanna deal with their disrespect because it, it offends you so much that you have a hard time letting go. It's so offensive. I remember one time, what was, one, one time a girl, I, I told her I was leaving Mexico, and I was like, "Yo, let me, can I can I have you hold on to my weed?" 
until I come back. Anyways, she said yeah. When I came back, she she did she fucking blocked me. Like that type of shit, right? I mean, that's that's that doesn't go with the example. But that that was my kind of disrespect, right? Anyways, look for what what is the number one sign that a guy's gonna disrespect you? Look for those things. What think think in the past? What things led to disrespect? Write it down, and do not accept that from anybody. That should be your, your number one goal. Because if I can help you identify the disrespectful men, the men that are gonna talk bad to you, like calling you a bitch, making fun of you, trying to isolate you from your family, all of those things, if you're able to identify it, your relationships with men in general are gonna get better over time. It's that simple, all right? All right, ladies, this is Alex. By the way, we're having a 30% off all of our courses today, um, this week only until the end of the year 30 percent off the courses as a thank you to all of you guys because this has been an incredible year for mindful attraction and for the toxic gang this has been an incredible year for my elections and an incredible years for everyone who follows me and even the freeloaders so let me know what what was your favorite content this year um and let me know how i have helped you this year in the comments down below i really like to read those kind of things okay all right peace out take care all right ladies so i know you guys have checked out many different courses many different books on how to create and maintain a long-lasting relationships but not many of them have the structure that we're going to be having in this course which is natural chemistry this course you guys have been waiting for for a few months and i've been having a an extremely great time coming out with this course because this course is so unique that I was tempted to call it the greatest course of all time for women, to be honest with you. But, you know, I have to stay humble, all right? This course is a five-week course, ladies and gentlemen. A five-week course with a bunch of bonuses on how to maintain, how to keep the guys, create chemistry, and have long-lasting relationships that are healthy and that make you thrive, all right? We're going to be talking about the week one. We're going to be talking about strategies for creating and maintaining a deep connection. Right? I'm going to be going over all of the strategies to do that. After week two, we're going to be talking about male nature, understand, helping you understand a different kind of guys. After that, we're going to be talking about how to control your emotions when you're in love. After that, we're going to be talking about how to set boundaries. Each week, you get a new video so that you're able to digest it in a, in a slow way. After that, we're going to be talking about how to embrace your masculine and your feminine, right? On top of that, we're going to have a bunch of bonuses, bonuses such as how to the breakup formula, connecting and communicating with your man, establishing a life of abundance, social mastery, understanding your dark side, maintaining your self-esteem, the goal setting seminar, um, practical mastery, how to master anything, which is what I used to learn how to draw. The laws of human nature, we're going to be talking about the three chapters, the law of irrationality, the law of narcissism, and learning how to see through people's masks. We're going to have the transformational seminar in a pocket for those who purchase, the, for those who are the first 30 purchases. We're going to be talking about the chase. No, we're going to be giving you guys the free audiobook, which is the chase, right? All of this, people, you get with a 30-day money-back guarantee. That's right, a 30-day money-back guarantee. So if you don't like it, you could just return it. And the price of all of this starts at $197. We have a whole bunch of different packages, but the beginning price is $197, ladies and gentlemen. Right? So I know you guys will like this because this course originally was going to cost over $2,000. Actually, $1,800, but I decided to not put in some content. But it was originally priced at $1,800. Um, $1, but I'm going to be giving to you guys starting at 197 ladies and gentlemen, with a 30-day money-back guarantee. That means if you don't like it, or if you guys just want to try it out, because we all have the freeloaders out there. I don't mind. Go ahead and give it a try, freeloaders, because you guys will also get free previews of the video. So if, you, if for all the freeloaders out there, you guys can check it out. And I do not mind. Please check it out, because even the free videos are useful. Because at the end of the day, this is to help you guys. This is to help you guys create natural chemistry. This is to help you guys create that love and bond that you guys always wanted with your man. That means if you're in a relationship, you will learn how to deepen that relationship. If you're not in a relationship, you will learn how to not fuck it up. All right? So I'll see you guys inside because I can promise you, this is the best course I've made. And I've made plenty of different courses for men and women. This is the best course 
I made. It is comprehensive. It has over 10 hours of content, ladies and gentlemen. So I'll see you guys inside, and I hope to see you guys there. Don't forget, there's a 30-day money-back guarantee. No questions asked. So if you don't like it, you could just return it. All right? Okay. See you guys inside. Bye-bye.